Yeah, man, I inside. Be a chapstick. You wanna know about this? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Mar. Back at it again with another video. You feel me? What's up? Today's topic, I'm finna be talking about the number one way you'll know if if a female is into you. Now, this is a true story, right? I was dating someone and they saw that I had a lot of options, right? You know what 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 happens with most women when they see that you have a lot of options and other women want you they either do one or two things they leave or they stay let me tell you why they would leave they leave because they already was talking to someone else they stay because you were the only one that they're talking to at the time so they feel like okay uh, let me keep this guy because he's my best option for now right it could always change don't think just because you got her now don't think that you got her you know f for a, forever it's no such thing as forever so say if you say if you're in a relationship right and your girlfriend sees that other women find you attractive, right? What's gonna happen is she's gonna like think to herself like, nah, this guy really has, you know, all these options. And she may think like, okay, one or, you know, one or three of the girls look better than her, right? That's gonna make her go crazy. If the girls that like you look better than her, she's gonna stay for this that fact that women like to compete with each other. Feel me? So she's gonna do things like little things like wear her makeup, facial beauty, you know, get beautified. Right? And then in return she's gonna chase your validation she's gonna be like oh do i look good in this do i look good in that right this is validation but you got to be careful with how much validation you give because if you give too much of it it's not valuable that's just how it works so what I noticed, where say, okay, I was, I was like in a five month relationship with someone, and like a fool at the time, me and her exchanged passwords, just because, like, you know, I thought that was a way for her to trust me and let her guard down. Right. So, she had my password. She saw other females. In my inbox, texting me, all that good stuff, right? You know the run-ins. So, one thing I realize is this. When you move like you don't want her, you have other options. That's when she values you more and she'll want to more, like she'll want to be around you more. So, I'm going to give you two examples today, right? So when you have a when you have a girlfriend and she sees that other women want you, she'll most likely want to stick around more because she'll notice that there's more to you. You know, you're not just only talking to her. Other women find you attractive, and then she's gonna want to comp want to compete with that. Right? This is how you keep them. Now on the flip side say um you know before anything serious or exclusive happens this is how you trap them into this game of letting like you know deciding if they have high interest or not 
You tell them this phrase. You tell them, I don't want a relationship. Right? And then she's going to most likely ask you why. And you just say stuff like, um, you know, I just don't like females that play games. Right? Now what's going to happen is she's going to be like, well, I don't play games. I don't do this. I don't do that. She'll say this, right? But at the same time, you have to put those words to the test because actions are louder than words, right? So you got to become cold, beat around the bush, push and pull. She's going to notice that you're moving a certain kind of way where you're not as into her, but you still entertain her. So what's going to happen is um, she's going to prove her worth to you as opposed to you proving your worth to her. And it's just, you know, it's reverse psychology. Because what happens when we really, when men really like a girl and they tell her and they tell him that they don't want a relationship nine times out of ten. He would go crazy and tell himself, okay, I have to prove her wrong. You know, maybe other guys has pumped and dumped her. And, you know, let me prove to her that I'm not that guy. It's, it's a psychological game with them. So when you move like you don't want a relationship and you let them know the reasons why you don't want a relationship, she's going to be able to qualify herself right then and there and be like okay i'm not gonna do this i'm not gonna do that you know let me get on his program and if she's really into you she's going to follow your lead follow your protocol not play games remember females that want you they're into you they don't play games this is the truth this is what you guys have to get through your head like don't be out here proving your worth to a female just don't be like hey i'm here choose me you will get rejected you're gonna get crushed she's gonna take your energy you won't have any other energy any more energy to pursue your dreams or have energy for the girl that really wants to be around you this is how it works Energy is energy is really important. You know, you let you let the wrong people around your orbit, they will steal your energy and you won't have any more energy to function with anyone else. And I know this firsthand. So to wrap this all up, you gotta move like you do not want the relationship. You could sell her, I don't want a relationship. Or you can tell them, I'm not ready to settle down right now. Because they want a guy that's doing his own thing. He's pursuing his purpose. He puts her second. The moment you put her first, she's going to put you last. You treat her like a celebrity, she's going to treat you like a fan. So this is why you have to move like you don't want her. You gotta have the outcome independence that you're just, you know, playing along in the game. Like, for real, for real. I know this firsthand. The only, the only real way you're gonna get a female attached to you is moving like you don't want her. You know, you just keeping things light and playful. Now, once you master this skill, you're going to have more women in your rotation because, you know, women are like children. You got to really have that playful mindset. Not to say that you're going to cheat on them, but you got to, you know, you got to become hot and cold. You got to give and take away. That's the only way you're going to really know if she's into you or not. So example of this is this. Um, an example of her not being into you is for this reason right here. Say if, you know, you 
her and talking to her. Everything is going good. You're being consistent. And the moment you pull back even once and she just forgets about you after you pull back that one time, that shows that, you know, she wasn't high interest because a high interest woman would feel that pullback and be like, okay, what's wrong with this guy? Let me go see what's wrong with him and let me see why he pulled back. They would, they want to chase you, but you have to do some work at it and leave like a good, like a good imprint enough for them to be like, okay, there's more to this guy. You know, he's mysterious. He does his own thing. You know, he pops up here and there. Once you master this, they will find you irresistible. That's all I got to say. Like, comment, subscribe, share to your friends. Peace. Fave now, give me a mad feeling, but the grenade great. With the grab a leaf, send me go a place where gravity not exists.